Hi everyone, Mikasa Dragon here, and I just bought me some level 70 gear. Looking alright. Looking different. I still rather have. This looks better. We got level 71. And today I just want to talk about. the the fill of leveling characters in the old school maple story because compared to what it is now oh man it is completely different i'm going to go over the general types just you know thief uh warriors that type of stuff and um I'm not gonna... I can't do fourth job. I never made it that far before Big Bang. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll just share my experience with the characters I made. But let's, let's do the general stuff first. So, so warriors were probably the easiest to use. Overall, um... It was still somewhat slow, but at least you had enough HP. The only thing is like, you waste HP pot, and then you need like, you probably need a lot of MP pot, just so you don't have to go back all the time. Those are the small ones, so it wasn't, it wasn't that expensive. Uh, let's see. Bowmen, Bowmen were second to last in my opinion. I want to put this on like ranking. So Bowman was second to last. Well, not last. Second, second hardest class to do because um, they they couldn't be close to the enemies when they attacked, but their bow had knockback. So like. I'm just going to say, like, a level 50 bow might have, like, 45% knockback. So, it was a bit easier for that. But if the monsters were, like, a lot, then you could have some trouble there. They couldn't truly jump attack if you press the buttons, like, at the same time. It could work. Uh, mages are kind of like warriors. But their biggest downfall is that back in the old day, uh, what's it? Magic. No, I forgot the name of the skill. Oh, Magic Guard was not a toggle skill. Meaning, and, and don't forget, back in the day, not everyone had good internet or a good PC. So, if you're training, in like a high level area and without magic guard you'll get one shot and you just disconnect and it's on a map where they don't put you on a safe spot they just spawn you right where the monsters are you would just instantly die and there would be nothing that you could do about it that's the only downfall yeah so you had to I guess the other thing is you have to remember to keep up Magic Guard. Oh my god. Um, so I will say they're a bit harder. They're, but they're the second easiest. Um, I don't know how I feel about this. I'm going for the basic four, but I will add in pirates. Um, these have it in my opinion the hardest because they don't truly get an AoE and when they do get it it still sucks so you still have to like basically grind through it all but yeah their second job is is terrible all single targets um all right now we move on to pirates pirates are they're like bandits and assassins. 
but you know, one has a gun, one uses their fist. I would say they're easier. They might tie for like Bowman. Um, I think, yeah, I think they tie with Bowman. They're pretty good, but they're not like super amazing. And they can still die pretty easily, so you gotta watch out for that. So, from my experience, I did... My first character was Warrior, but I didn't make it that far. Let, let me just go with... Um, characters I actually leveled. So, my first one was Assassin. And it was very, very hard. Much harder than this, because... You wouldn't have gear like this. So I'll be a lot weaker. And using Shadow Partner was a thing. It was just like this. Just a lot weaker. Oh my god, the 191. It'll be like 40. Um At least when we get third job, we get an AoE, but it only hits four monsters. And if you want to be greedy and get flash jump, you're delaying that. the Shadow Partner. Shadow Partner and Avenger max out at level 30, which means it takes 10 levels to max them out. So you're going to be level 90 if you just max those two straight out. But I want flash jump, so... I'm going to be like 93 before you're at a decent spot and then you got to max out flash jump which will put you at like level 100 almost I want to say like 98 and then you can do like one of these two Shadow Meso, it's kind of lame I've seen it, it's, it's pretty lame um, but yeah uh, we get an AoE, and then we get triple throw, third job, and I forget what else. Uh, no, I mean fourth job, fourth job. Um, bandits, they have it rough. They have it so rough. Their AoE skill is worse than ours. So they have to still rely on Savage Blow for their, like, main damage. Uh, you just use Assassinate just to stun the enemy. It doesn't really do that much damage. And guess what? Only Hermits get a Shadow Partner. Bandits did not get one. Uh, Bowman, I only made a Marksman, which I didn't even make it to a Marksman. I, I never made it to third job with that, but uh, at least for them, second job, they get a AoE, so it is manageable, but it's still kind of... These and Bowman and Pirates are on the weaker side, because their weapons are kind of bad for damage, so your damage isn't like super high until you like crit. And the, it's the crit that really helps out. What? Let me see. For assassins, you only get 50% chance. And they don't tell you anything else about crit, so you, so you gotta like find that out. Um. For mages, they have it somewhat easy. Because you can, like, train on an element type that's weak against yours. But, um, the hardest two would be Fire Poison and, um, and Cleric. Cleric, you gotta, like, wait till you're high enough level to train at, like, zombie lupins. Or anywhere it's, like, a zombie type. And then, um... What's it called? 
fire poison. They had single target skill until third job. Or they finally get eruption or explosion. Not eruption, explosion. Um, warriors, they're good, but their AoE sucks. Their range of their AoE is like, well, well, like only hit these first two, but not anything farther than that. It is so bad. And final attack is, it's, it's okay. Back in the day, any extra damage is is good. So, Ooh. they they had like very very bad AOE, and Dragon Knights had it the best because they their AOEs became like good at their job. But heroes and paladins, ooh, you gotta keep struggling. Because paladins, they didn't really get a new skill, per se. They they just added elemental to their attacks. So you're basically stuck using their second job's AoE skill to do AoE damage. Uh, Heralds, I think Heralds got something, but it was still bad. And then Pirates, Outlaw was pretty good, but like, still kind of slow. Because you yeah, had like two different elements, you need like two different bullets if you wanted those elements. For third job to be stronger. Their glide mechanic was pretty fun. At first, you would only glide for how high you can jump and then slowly glide down. And then like one day, they're like, we need to buff this. And then you would jump like, like super high. It was ridiculous how high you would jump. You would jump almost like to the top of the screen. And that was, that was so fun. I loved Outlaws. Uh, Buccaneers was better than Bandits because at least they're AoE. They, they had AoE and they can like push forward closer to the monsters faster than rather than having to have to walk up to them. But the, the annoying thing is you have to activate their dash skill all the time because if they didn't they was pretty slow yeah i don't think i hit third job with no i think i did i don't know that was a lot a lot of time because leveling was super slow and show you example for how slow leveling was you'll be proud if you can hit level 30 in one day that would be amazing because no one wanted to do that it took so long but yeah If I forgot anything, leave a comment. And I'm gonna try to get this assassin to level 80. Over time, of course. So I keep getting distracted by other games. So like, comment, share, and subscribe, and see you guys next time. Bye. Alright, before I go, just quick overview. Warriors. First job. Everyone's first job was kind of meh. Second job. 
it would kind of suck, but you just dealt with it because you had enough HP and defense. Um, mages. Keep that magic guard up to survive. Good AoE for Ice Lightning. Had a struggle with others. Um, so mages were kind of meh. Only one one stood out for training at least until like third job. Then two stood out. Uh, Bowmen. They both kind of played the same. <coughs> the same. <coughs> Excuse me. Bowmen both played the same. First job, kind of meh. Second job, get an AoE. Third job, get an AoE and a pet. Um, thieves, pretty bad. Took a lot of hard work, but somewhat worth it. More assassins was worth it. Bandits had a struggle till fourth job. And then pirates. Pirates had it good. I think it was somewhat strong. Still slow. Everyone's still slow in this game. Um, both had AoE. Second job. Third job. More AoE. More skills. And yeah. yeah. That's it. Bye.